Hey guys, today's going to be a really interesting and, and weird story time. I wasn't even sure if I was going to make a video about this. I awoke from a horrifying nightmare a couple of nights ago and I felt very weird. I felt like I had been penetrated. You know when you wake up from like a really weird dream? The kind of dream where like you maybe had sex with your ex-boyfriend and you wake up and you're like kind of turned on but also horrified and shocked at the same time. Maybe the problem is, is that I've been celibate too long. Like maybe I just need some penis in my life. Maybe this is a life lesson to everybody. Like if you don't get some D on the reg, you'll end up having sex dreams about Donald Trump. So let me tell you guys a little bit about this dream. In my dream, I stayed at the Trump Hotel in Soho, which makes perfect sense because I have in fact stayed at the Trump Hotel in Soho many, many times. It's a lovely hotel, lovely staff. Hello guys. I went with my Asian ex-boyfriend about a year ago and you guys got us really good seats to Kingy Boots. Props to you. I met Donald Trump at the Trump Soho Hotel and we hit it off. And apparently we got very close. He wanted to help me. He wanted to pay for my lifestyle. And I kept, I kept saying, no, Donald, please. I can't let you support me because I'm an independent woman. And Donald Trump just insisted. He bought me an apartment on the Upper East Side and then it just kind of like flashed over to my new apartment on the Upper East Side. And I was like kind of sort of living with Donald Trump and he was very nice to me, but our relationship wasn't very sexual. And I felt bad because he was buying me all of these extravagant things. So I kind of felt like, damn, I really gotta give it to Donald because he's buying me all of these nice things. Basically, Donald Trump was my sugar daddy in this dream. And my dream had Donald Trump looking pretty good, actually. Like, if you look at Donald Trump now, he really doesn't look good. It kind of looks like whoever gave him a spray tan had a traumatic brain injury. And his comb over has been looking less like a fluffy pile of cotton candy and more like a really sad tumbleweed. Like, trust me, guys, in my dream, Donald Trump kind of looked bae. He was kind of hot dad status. I know Donald Trump is married. In my dream, he was not married. I know Donald Trump Trump in the past has really liked Eastern European women, which makes sense because I'm from Czech Republic. His ex-wife is actually Czech, so like I am right up his alley. This dream actually makes a lot of sense, other than the fact that I fucking hate Donald Trump. So eventually I decide to give it to good old Donald and we're laying in bed and we are about to make sweet love and then I wake up and I feel turned on, like, oh, that was kind of hot. But then I also am like, oh, but I don't like Donald Trump. That's freaking gross. Ew, why am I having a sex dream about Donald Trump? Stephanie, what's wrong with you? I don't even know you anymore. And the first thing I did when I woke up was told my mom and her response in her Czech accent was, are you crazy? Even though I don't find Donald Trump attractive and even though I don't agree with him politically at all, the dream was still kinda hot. It was one of those dreams where it felt so wrong, but a part of it also felt really right. And I feel like if he does become our president, it's gonna be really awkward for me because I'll be like, I had sexual dreams about that man. So yeah, I had sex with Donald Trump in my dream. I hope you guys enjoyed this story time. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you like my story time videos. Also, it helps out my channel so much and makes me so happy. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking that subscribe button down below. My social media is down there as well. So if you wanna follow me on there and ask me questions and talk to me and be my best friend, that's cool too. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye. <coughs>